welcome back to Good Day State Line. This week is National School Choice Week. Tonight we are chatting with Anthony from Empower Illinois about what that really means for students here in our state. How are you? Michelle, I'm wonderful this morning. Thanks so much for having me. Yeah, so tell us a little bit about Empower Illinois as a program. Happy to. So Empower Illinois is a statewide scholarship granting organization. Uh, what that means is we receive dollars through the state's Invest in Kids Act program, our tax credit scholarship program. Mm -hmm. Two main features of the program, uh, individuals throughout the state make a donation. In exchange for that donation, they get a 75% credit off their state income tax. Okay. So if you give $1,000, $750 right off the top of your income tax. The great news is those dollars then we convert into scholarships for kids to go to private schools throughout Illinois. That seems pretty beneficial for everyone. It is. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't see any flaws in that. So we national, like your thinking. Yeah, yeah, right. National School Choice Week Absolutely. is is this week. So, like, what exactly does that mean? Sure. National School Choice Week uh, for us and for uh, many other organizations throughout the country is an opportunity to celebrate kids and their opportunity to attend their best fit school, whether that's a, a great public school, a great public charter school, or a great private school. Uh, we're celebrating kids and families and in great fit education this week. Can I ask you how long this idea of kids picking a school at a younger age has been around? Um, so, uh, a absolutely. Okay. So, so uh, in, in reference to the program yeah. uh, that we manage, the Invest in Kids Act Tax Credit Scholarship Program, that law was passed in 2017 okay. and became uh, kind of a program in January of 2018. So we've been working for the past four years now on this program um, and across the state, Across that entire period of time, over $250 million has been raised. Wow. Um, close to 30,000 scholarships for kids in every single corner of the state and every community. Um, you know, kids finding a, a great fit school. I ask that because in my age of my <laughs> mid 30s, I'm like, no one is asking me where I want to go to school or giving me this, right. this idea that right. maybe school A is not fit for you just because it's fit for your brother or your cousin yep. or your best friend. Yep. Like, I love this idea of kids at a younger age figuring out that everyone is not going to have the same path because usually we or at least like I said for people my yeah. age we're going to wait till we into college no, to figure that out. <laughs> certainly you know for me personally I grew up in rural Minnesota uh -huh. um, you know everybody went to the same middle school there's only one mm -hmm. same high school uh, only one but your point Michelle is is very well made not every school is is the right fit for every student and um, because of great programs like the tax credit scholarship program parents can find that great fit and uh, they have these opportunities regardless of, what we like to say, their zip code or mm -hmm. their income. Let's not let those factors yeah. uh, you know, be barriers to one of the most important decisions that the parents make uh, for their kids. Absolutely, so we're talking about it you know, today because it is National School Choice Week, but does this week mean anything um, for donors or a scholarship applicants? Like, is this a good time or is any time a good time? So, Every day is okay. a good day if you care about <laughs> kids and want to change their lives for the better. Um, but this week especially, we're very excited. Um, we will certainly be uh, posting a lot on social media. You'll see a lot of uh, great opportunities to raise the profile of this program. So if folks are interested to learn more, either to apply or to make a donation, they can go to our website, empowerillinois.org. I'm guessing there's not too much involved in the donation process other than making the donation. Yes, so um, I wish that were that simple, okay. but it's not so bad, <laughs> it's not so bad, trust me. We've got a great team and they're uh, always ready, willing and able to help. Um, but because donors receive a state tax credit, yeah. uh, they have to start uh, with the at the Department of Revenue, okay. set up an account, but then they come to our website uh, again, on our website, empowerillinois.org, uh, there are links to chat or call and speak to our amazing customer success team to help walk cool. through that donation process. And then on the flip side, um, kids or families that are interested in scholarships, what's that process like? Uh, it's it's uh, also starts on our website, so that's the, that's the that's hub good. for everything. Um, and they'll go uh, click on, there's a banner at the top of our website now that'll be running for several months. Okay. Kids can, uh, families apply and they pick the school uh, that they'd like to uh, you know, potentially receive a scholarship at, and then uh, they'll go in line and we'll, we're starting awarding scholarships uh, next week. Okay, and how so. many scholarships a year do you guys give out? So th these are the numbers uh, that are uh, moving uh, in a lot of ways. So this past year we gave, uh, we awarded 6,000 scholarships. Pretty big. That's a big number, yeah. that's a really big number. <laughs> uh, what's even larger than that is the number of kids who have raised their hand and said, I want one of these scholarships. So uh, last year we had about almost 30,000 kids in wow. line 
So about five times the number of applicants uh, compared to our ability sure. uh, to meet them. So uh, overwhelming demand throughout the state, kids and families raising their hands. Uh, and our job is to work every single day with donors to make sure we can make more and more scholarships well, available. Cool. Well, what a perfect time for you know you to come visit us. So thank you so much for yes. stopping by. Thank of course, you. you can get all those details, though I bet you heard Anthony say them already, empowerillinois.org, and uh, you can follow them all over social media, and there's the number two. Thank you so much. Michelle, thank you very much. <laughs> Coming up next on GDS, we're digging into Tuesday Trends with Super Bowl champ Mark Slareth. Don't go anywhere.